Hey, what's up guys? This is the King Hunter. I know what episode is Tower Commander Rebels. And here we go. We are under attack. People are attacking us. This is really entertaining. It's not like a, with the big account with the Empire when nobody is even trying attacking me. You hear this? So many things going on. So I'm going to show you this and then we're going to analyze the layout of my base to just to see if it's actually working. And I believe it is because for the last five attacks, I'm being... I've been able to stop the Empire five times, so that's pretty good, 100% for now. So, for example, this one, well, I got some good support from the squad center and also those mortars in the middle of the base, close to the headquarters, are just critical. Those are the ones allowing me to take care of all the infantry units, especially if somebody tried to deploy all the stone troopers in one specific location, the mortar can take care of them in one go. Let's go to, for another replay. Oh, in this attack, there are snipers and there are also do-bags. I still have my rebel soldiers getting out of the squad center. So, so, so useful. So taking care of those guys. They were trying to deploy close to the mortar so they can take care of that turret, but... The idea of my layout is to have rapid fire tourists covering the mortar. So if somebody is trying to get deployed really close to my base or close to the mortars, I should be able to stop them on their tracks. You see the set? Ah, they have a... Oh, dude, you, you already spent... You spent so much stuff attacking me, dude. Uh, okay, I know. You're trying to take my resources. That's fine. That's fine. Maybe I'm going to attack you back right now, but... As you can see, we got another victory, 100, well, 36% damage, 100%, that's not a win. So let's go and analyze real quick what is the current status of the base. Okay, so right here we got the base. Uh, how do we go and change the layout? I believe, because I think it's, it's a little bit different in the, there you go. Okay, so this is what I've been doing. Uh, in the middle, we got the headquarter. Remember, it's headquarter level three. So a lot of things I'm gonna change once once that we're still getting into headquarter four and five and shield generators and all the stuff. But for now, I only have access to mortars and rapid fire turrets. So what I'm doing, I'm trying to deploy the mortars really close to the headquarter, creating a, a perimeter. You see, there is one wall in the top, wall in the south, north, south, whatever. Okay, and also we got this. Uh, we're gonna see if we can get the grab this trap. Perfect. All right, so the idea will be for me uh, to have the rapid fire tourists protecting the the mortar. Let me see if I can move this one. It's not that easy when I play in in the emulator. It's a lot easier when you play my mobile to move stuff. But that's fine. Okay, I guess it's fine. Uh, you know what? Actually, we're gonna move this one one more. So if somebody starts attacking me from this side, it's gonna attack first the allowed refinery instead of the rapid fire turret. Unless it's a bruiser, of course. And in this side, I think we're fine. Most of the most of the players are trying to attack me from here, but if you're part of the squad and you can have a, a couple in this case, for example, have a couple of uh, rebel soldiers. Oh look at that. Wow. We even have a a heavy soldier from Dart. Thank you, Dart. I appreciate that, my friend. So if they're trying to attack me from here, I got the troops, I got the rapid fires, and also got the mortar. In the other corner, I got the other mortar, I got the other rapid fire turrets, and in the middle, I got a trap in case somebody trying to deploy units close to my mortar. That is what we're trying to accomplish, trying to bother our opponent as much as possible so they're going to make mistakes. Uh, what else is happening? Let's go. We'll go to the research lab. I need to upgrade the research lab. Thank you so much. I just remember that. Otherwise, I won't be able to upgrade any units. Big mistake, <laughs> big mistake. Uh, what else do we have? We got the, we still don't have access to a solo. We need to level up. I don't know, we got this one. We need to level up to get access to Leia. No, we also got access to Leia. Great, okay. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'm finishing upgrading a couple buildings and mortars I'm gonna need to move to level three. It's taking me a level longer to get to the next level, because I haven't been able to play Lady, but uh, I was able to play the last conflict. I didn't do that well, because I just didn't have enough time to to go through the whole conflict, which is something that I, I wish they fix in the future, so do you need to spend 24 hours, 48 hours playing the game just to be able to unlock a new unit? But well, that's, another, that's another conversation. Uh, not too bad, we still got some resources. Thank you so much. With that, we should be able to start upgrading the research 
lab perfect that's what we need so we can start upgrading our stormtrooper so how about if we do a revenge attack in one of these empire players they were trying to destroy my base i think it's a good idea if we go back and give them a teach them a lesson you guys are ready let's go here we go let's see oh mm -hmm. rapid fires inside a wall that's no good that's not good uh the good thing is that at least we can steal their resources See, we can steal resources and get some damage coming from there. We can deploy Shui. Shui at level 1 is not the best. But we're going to do, we're going to clean this path. We're just going to save a couple of uh, rebel soldiers. If they get too close to the base, the mortar is going to take care of business. So, now that we're getting closer, we can deploy Shui. Perfect. And once that we start destroying the buildings from the top, we're going to deploy the other two Wookiees. With those two Wookiees, we are going to be able to, there you go, provide some support to our hero. Uh, let's see, can we rush this? Because otherwise, by the time the troops get to the middle, she is going to be dead. Okay, well, we got one of the Wookiees on the attention of one of the rapid fire turrets. Ah, that was, that was pretty clean. That was a pretty clean attack. Shui, if Shui can take care of the mortar, it's GG. There's nothing that this guy is going to be able to do. 80%, we got it. Revenge! Revenge is complete. Awesome! 100%, yes. Hopefully we have enough troops so we can go for another attack and we get another revenge for the other Empire player who decide to attack me. Okay, perfect. Perfect, that will come very well. So, like I said, it's very important. It's very important to, to understand how to deploy the troops um, this is not like uh, there is some other yes, uh, strategy games when you can we just deploy whatever you need just masses and right. masses of troops and eventually they're going to be able to take care of business and bring down the base but in star wars you have to be careful you have to be really tactical i mean for example a mortar is capable to destroy the a whole army of infantry units so let just be careful what is the order in which um, in which order you're deploying yes, the units on the battlefield and make sure that they are getting supported by the, for example, bruisers. Trying to mix, of course, bruisers with the looters and also some uh, infantry units. Let's go for another attack. Let's go for the other revenge attack. Okay, okay, okay. Base number two. Rapid fires. Mortar. Only one mortar. That's good. Uh, building the factory. Not bad. I would love to know if there is anything in the squad center, just in case, if nothing is in there... Okay, then we're gonna deploy Shui. Perfect. I'm gonna deploy that. One soldier from here. I'm gonna deploy a couple of Wookiees. Make sure to provide... Uh, deploy them. Little by little... Am I missing troops or...? No. I think... I think it's... No, I think I got enough. Um, I don't have that many, that's the thing. <laughs> I'm so used to play with the, the, the big account with the Empire. When I see an army, only 20 units, like, what? Why are we, <laughs> can, we, can we do something with this? It's too tiny. But I think we're fine. You see, one more time, we were able to protect all the rebel soldiers. So by the time, well, you see the Wookiees are taking care of every single the tourists. The, the little rebel soldiers, they're only taking care of the buildings. I think we had a hundred percent in this one, but also with a hundred percent quality of attack. That means that no no troops were injured in this attack. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna put a disclaimer. Perfect. Not too bad. Hundred percent. We got it. Excellent. We got plenty of uh, alloy, so we can either start grading one of the turrets because they are asking me for twenty thousand alloy, which is quite a lot. And the other option that we have, actually going to start getting ready for the next episode, because the next episode will be solo. We're going to have solo, okay? And we're also going to start using this, our friends dead, looters. So we're going to go with looters. Oh, I don't have them. It's just one. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, we haven't unlocked yet the, the Pathfinder. No, those are not the Pathfinders, right? Oh, yes. Yeah, Pathfinder. 
There's another Pathfinder. Yes, they are the Pathfinder Hunter. What are you talking about? But we haven't unlocked the Pathfinder. That's what I'm trying to say. All right, perfect. All right, so I'm going to get everything ready for the next episode. And in the meantime, we're going to start upgrading my... The Squad Center has been mwah, amazing. Helping me so much. Uh, 8,000... I got only one droid available. I think it's a good idea we start upgrading one of the mortars. Yeah. At this level, 20,000 is a lot of resources. So I don't wanna, I don't wanna lose those resources if somebody decides to attack me. I was planning to upgrade one of the credit vault, but then I decided, you know what? If I'm gonna disconnect now and I'm not gonna play for a couple hours, Maybe it's a good idea to spend in the more expensive building. So that way it's going to be a better investment. Fellas, this is the Game Hunter. I know what episodes Tower Commander Rebels. Do not forget to like, subscribe, share my videos. Do not forget to activate notifications so you don't miss any videos. I, yeah, I heard myself. <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. Take care, fellas. <laughs>